I got to thinking about our flea beetle problem on our uh, eggplant. I know they sell uh, sticky traps that are yellow that are supposed to be or can be used to uh, trap uh, flea beetles. The flea beetles apparently attracted to the yellow color. Well, I got to thinking I have some plain old sticky traps that are white. I wondered if they would work. So what I've done is taped one to the back of the stake and then now I'm going to peel off the uh, protect, protective cover there and we're going to see if this will catch flea beetles. Okay there it is. We'll come back and check on it later and see how it does. Well we didn't get too many but we do actually have a few flea beetles on the sticky trap and there's a grasshopper so that's a good thing and some kind of little beetle. But I guess it's better than nothing. And then I was watching a video about uh, fleas on uh, the Empty Nester channel. Uh, he was uh, showing how to get rid of fleas. And it gave me the idea to try this uh, styrofoam dish with some dish soap and some water in it. And as you can see, we actually did catch some little flea beetles in there. So that's one more way to get a few. I just happen to think uh, that flea beetles jump just like fleas, so they can't always land on another leaf. So having this dish underneath the plants gets a few of them and I'm not sure if those are mosquito eggs or what I'm not I'll take a closer look at that when I get it on the computer but I'm not sure what those little black things are floating in the water well, it's been a couple of days and it looks like our little experiment uh, actually worked. And not only did we get a bunch of uh, flea beetles, there's a little blister beetle there and a grasshopper over there. So it's getting other bad bugs just uh, other than the flea beetles. So, since I know that it works, I had three more traps and I rigged up some more. So we'll see what happens with these. One thing I found interesting is not only does this, uh, these plates full of uh, soapy water catch flea beetles, but they also catch the uh, blister beetles. And the blister beetles can really do a lot of damage, so glad to see that. I think what happens is the blister beetles like to just drop from the plant to the ground sometimes. And when they drop, if there's a plate of uh, soapy water on the ground and they drop into it, they're gone. So that works out pretty good. And there's a blister beetle. Yeah, he's a blister beetle with no head. 